What's up guys, welcome back to Oldity Lifestyle. Today we're gonna to be doing a hotel tour at the Bahia Grand Principal in Jamaica, Runaway Bay. Let's get it. So that Bob Marley stand. I think here last night there was a steel band. I can't remember what night it is tonight. There is a Bob Marley night, but I don't know when that, that is. So talking of that actually, there is a board um, down by the pool where it tells you each night what the entertainment is, um, which I think is really good. So yesterday we arrived on Thursday you have the steel band. Other nights you have different um, different types of entertainment. I don't know what's in there. There is like a football and a pool table in there, so maybe that's some type yeah. of like... Games, chill room. Yeah. Oh, that's cute, this little terrace thing. So I think if you want like a private romantic dinner... I think it was 68 US dollars, I imagine, wasn't it? Yeah, 68 US dollars. Um, I think that was on the... Was it on the beach? I don't know. I think it was a romantic dinner on the beach. I'm not sure if it was on the beach. I think it might be here as well, so maybe you can choose your location. These stairs are very confusing because they've got lots yeah. of black lines, so you think you're stepping <laughs> down one, yeah. and actually, you're not. Yeah, it's a bit confusing. So, yeah, that's why I nearly fell. And you've got the spot at the bottom of here. Don't forget, guys, if you're liking this content, then please subscribe to our Patreon. The link is in the description below. In terms of this particular trip, this wasn't booked with a major tour operator like TUI as an all-inclusive type package holiday. Um, we actually booked this through Love Holidays. Flights were through Virgin Atlantic. Transfers are through a local company and obviously the hotel is separate. But you have got two reps on site, I believe. I've seen a TUI stand. So what that tells me is, you know, it is a big, reputable hotel. Yeah, we got it for a really good price. I think we booked it on a Black Friday deal. Yeah, Black Friday last year. Um, so yeah, so we got it for a stupid price. And um, we did try to increase our time here. So we're only at this particular hotel for a week. We couldn't change it because it was just fully booked up. So what I would say, love holidays so far. Really good deals, but I would say if you're knowing that you might want to change dates or increase length of your stay, then it's probably not the best. I don't know what this side of the building is. It's like a sports bar. As you leave the reception, you've got all these drinks here. Coffees, cold drinks, croissants, cups of teas. It's a nice touch. So the problem you have with these stairs, right, is there's two black lines on here. So when you're first walking down, it can make it really difficult to see where the end of the step is. Right, so we're about to go in the pool. Some banana eating game. That's a game right, I'm not playing. Stretch your hand down. How cold this water is. Oh, it's cold. Different activities over there. You got all the beach chairs around as well. Yeah, a beautiful whole time. You're gonna have a good holiday. And it gets the old lifestyle five star rating. 
Now let's go and see what these what bananas these man can eat. It's not usually the type of thing I'm really into watching, but it seems as they're doing it on holiday. Let's go and see. Here are your bananas. So do you stretch your hand out. Here are your bananas. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, the entertainment is good here, you know. Yeah, entertainment is usually cringy, but this is actually genuinely good. Thank you. Carl, thank you so much for leaving your lunch to come over here for this one. Leanne, thank you. And of course, the man Jeff, aka Jason Statham, figure for nice clean self. So, we're going to go and get some drinks at the Bullside Bar. What are you drinking? What are you drinking? So what, what do you think of the hotel? It's cool. Okay, so the hotel is nice. What is it? It's really big. In Hawaii? I am still a lot, but I prefer like the three-story villas where it's like not so many people at one. And I prefer like an adult only where if I don't bring my kids, I don't want to listen to yours. That's... You know, but, on that side, they've got the luxury, on that side. And, yes, and they do. And that's only that. Side. But we couldn't get in. Remember, guys, don't forget to subscribe. If you're enjoying this content, follow us on Patreon, ODT.Lifestyle. So we just come down to the knife. Reservation was for 8 o'clock. It's now 20 past 8, and we've not been seated. So we finally got brought in 25 minutes past the reservation time. It's now quarter to, and we've been sitting down. Um, we still haven't ordered yet, so I think this is going to be a very, very long night. It's now uh, quarter to nine, and our table is booked for eight. Um, yeah, so we've just just got our drinks because we didn't get seen till twenty five past. So that's my starter. That's exactly how it's come. And that's how it's What's the time? Half past nine. Have you eaten yet? Nope. Have you ever started yet? Yes. Is it any good? Um, mine was okay. It was presented well. Um, well, kind of. It was on a nice plate. Um, yeah, I have no energy right now. Stairs <laughs> now to attempt to extend our room stay for a couple of hours. So, checkout time is 12 o'clock. We're going to try and extend it until 5 as our pickup comes at 10 past 5. So, it just gives us a little bit of extra time. It allows us for the rest of the day to kind of relax and not have to worry about. Leaving bags here, leaving bags there, we're on the right clothes. $10 for every hour. Tip, there's a clubhouse. So if you have to check out early like we do, there's actually a clubhouse. Uh, if you come through here, there's some seating. Look there, so you can charge your phone. And then there are showers. I know there's nobody in, in here now, so I can use the camera. You got your, to uh, you got your sinks. Toilets, racks for your towels, you've got some shower cubicles that you can come and use. So, depending on how this day goes, or maybe this one may not work. Top tip, that's where it is. And I will show you the location. So, if we come out from here, up the stairs. Now, I don't think many guests actually know where this is. So you come out, there's the main view. You've got the drinks and coffees there and you just go through those doors there, clubhouse as you can see. And that's how you find that little room. So, final thoughts on this hotel. If you're thinking about booking it, book it. If there is space to book an upgrade to the luxury, do it. It's a fantastic hotel. Tip the staff when you can. Again, I've given it a ODT five star rating. All the staff, really helpful, really friendly. And I think if you come here, you'll have a, a really good stay.
Yeah, we'll definitely walk away from the three on the side. One of those things, unless you know about it, you're not going to do it. Do you know what I mean? Uh, it seems like most of the people that I've upgraded to luxury are people that are, have come here before and are returning. So, yeah, there's my little, little tip. You get that one for free. We've come to the end of the Jamaica trip. As you can see, if you enjoyed our content, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. You can support us on the Patreon, oldt.lifestyle. Any final words? Come to Jamaica, you will love it. Best place ever. Definitely 100%. Now, all that's left to do is say goodbye to the room. Thank you.